and it's a privilege for me to say this, the Scott County Central School Board in this district voted unanimously to retire your number just like those that are up there on the, in those raptors. And if you would take a hold of that number back there, and we're going to do it now, on behalf of Scott County Central Braves, congratulations. Your jersey will never, and your number will never be worn by anybody else in this school district. Let's give him a big round of applause. Oh man, it's a uh, it's a true blessing, you know. Um, man, it's just it's indescribable, you know, having my my number retired and then to have my name on the court. You know, um, I remember when this gym was first built. You know, we used to play in no other gym when I was younger. From just playing, you know, summer games. But um, man, it's just it's an honor. I just want to thank the Scott County School Board, um, the mayors, um, my coaches. Uh, I just want to thank the fans for being here tonight. Um, this is a night that I can't remember, that I'm not going to forget. And I also want to thank my family for being here. You know. Yeah! Without them, none of this would be possible. You know, uh, from them teaching me, mentoring me, taking good care of me. Um, you know, all the years going to their house, eating up their food. You know, what I'm saying <laughs> just these simple things like that. You know, but um, this is truly amazing, and um, something that's going to go with me far. You know, uh, and for all the little kids here that's growing up, just because you're from a small town, just because. Your place isn't on the map. Doesn't mean that you can't work hard. Doesn't mean you can't sacrifice and have dedication. You know, you really want something, you really want to dream about it, go do it, you know. Yeah. Nobody will tell you otherwise. Um, but at the end of the day, it's about God and having faith. And I'm continuing to push and remember your family and where you come from, you know. That's always gonna be with me, you know, when I'm playing in DC. You know, every time I play, I think of you guys. Every single time. And um, that helps me push through everything. I'm gonna tell you a story. One, um, this last year, playing at Georgetown, um, I called my mom after a game that I just got done playing. Um, it was like right after I got on the bus, you know, I called her. I was like, Mom. It felt like I was playing at Scott Central again. <laughs> and it was after we went to Syracuse and played in front of 37,000 people. Yeah. <laughs> and um, I just saw you know, all the orange shirts and all the orange things. I was like, <laughs> I remember this place for somewhere, you know, <laughs> so, like I said, that just allowed me to relax and play the game that I love, yeah. you know, and I did it. And I just want to say thank you, and thanks for this night coming out here. Uh, thanks, Mr. McFerrin, for and Ms. Cookson and Ms. Nichols for yeah. setting this up for me. Uh, I just want to say thank you. And I wasn't really supposed to be doing this, but with it being said, uh, I guess I could point at a lot of things, but Bubba's career started when he was young. We kind of worked with him, but he's always had a mindset of working at whatever he wanted to achieve and going out doing it. 
You know, I had to push him a little bit, but for the most part, he's got good work ethics. He's intelligent. Kind of knows where he want to go. Uh, of course, one thing that I always tell him is, don't forget where you come from. Always put God first. And to just understand that he's blessed. I mean, there's been tons of kids that want to achieve what he's done, but hasn't made it. But, you know, he's had the talent, he's had the brain, he's had the athleticism. The thing of it is, is that at the end of the day, if you put in the work, you will be rewarded. And that's the one thing I've always told you. Put in the work, and you will be rewarded. A lot of us already heard, you know, Cookson is a good coach, a great coach. And I think, however you want to look at it, I went through the system with Cookson and it stayed with me. And that's one of the big reasons I brought him back to coach my son. Uh, I had to kind of twist his arm, but he came back and, and did a fantastic job. But uh, for all the kids out there that want to dream and want to, it's all about the work the dedication, and the sacrifice. So with my son, I've got another one that's coming along and we're trying to instill the same thing in him. So just remember, it's what you put your mind to do and succeed in that and take that to heart, you'll do fine. Thanks.